Hello, I'm Frida. I finally have a bigger Dollar Tree haul. I thought it was going to take me longer to get one, but today I managed to get a larger haul. And it's not me mega, but it's a little larger. I found these wall borders and I, I'm working on a DIY and I want to show it to you tomorrow. Maybe tomorrow, yes. And um, I I got this green one. It was in the school supply area. So this is green sparkly. And this is a just teal with flowers. And each, each border contains 14 pieces like this. So anyway... And I got this one because I think this is pretty with the teal and the white and the gray, the yellow. We go kind of go with my peacock theme, you know? Yeah. Matches with the curtains. And I wanted three of these. I have just two and I wanted one more of these gold shiny gold uh, body holders, as cute as they are. Um, the other two have other, have one has stripes and the other one has something else and this one has the polka dots. So, and I got a uh, bandana, breast cancer awareness bandana for my little girl. So she loves pink, so I think she'll like um, to play with it. And I got some decorative mesh with gold thread in it. Also considering, I don't know which one is going to look best with my DIY. So I'm, I'm going to have to look at it in, in a few different ways, in a different, two, few different ways kinds of light before I decide which thing I'm going to use. I was thinking of maybe mod podging this onto the surface or using some uh, one of these in, around the border. So I'm, the jury's still out on that. I found them. I did. I did. I found that um, there were only three kinds left in the box. I have four kids and I wanted four different ones, but alas, there were only three different ones left. So, uh, and I went to, to four Dollar Trees and it was only in one. And it was in the first one and I walked in the door and they were right parked right there at the front of the store. And I went around to other stores looking for them and I couldn't find any more. Of course, I only found them because I wasn't looking for them. But so cute and soft. <laughs> Mar Maricela and Sammy uh, had hauled the poop emoji. And I that that's what made me aware that they were out there. And that it was possible I would run into some. So, poopster. And here are the other two. I have... Um, Oh yeah, speaking of, I have a coupon for Customer Appreciation Day, which is going to be 10% off in $10, your purchase of $10 or more on uh, October 6th, 14th, Sunday, October 14th. So I want to uh, wait and go back for a haul on that day. And here is the laughing emoji. See how big he is? <laughs> so cute. Um, a few years ago, I had found a purple uh, devil. One of my kids chose it. And we still have it in the house. So this will be fun to add to their collection of emoji pillows. And here's the angry one. <laughs> so cute. I wish I'd know what which one I missed. <coughs> I 
There was a picture of one with heart eyes. And I wonder if that's the one I missed. I would have liked to get it too. <clears throat> but anyway, Mr. Angry. <laughs> I found, I got some, another pack of bagels for the kids to have for breakfast. Um, some more organization baskets. This was my great hunt this morning too for things that I can use to organize my kitchen cabinet. And I, I found this six packs of shrimp ramen for a dollar. I mean, Kroger sometimes has them for a dollar. So I'm thrilled. Got two of those. My kids, there's just something about a bowl of noodles that kids makes kids happy sometimes. I got some more chopping boards, chopping mats. I, I'm going to cut these up and use them um, in the bottom of these baskets because I'm going to put peel bottles in them and I don't want them to fall all the time so I'm going to set these. I'm going to cut these up and set it in there to make the bottom smooth. So. Chopping that. And I got some more of these. Because the other ones worked so well <coughs> that I purchased yesterday. And I just want to go ahead and use some more. to really organize my kitchen cabinet. Garbage in there. And here are some more of these. I, I want to, I'm over having a mess in my kitchen cabinets. I, I don't have that many, so I stuff things in there and then I was looking at a book I got at Dollar Tree, or a, yeah, I have it, I think. Um, or maybe, I don't remember where I picked it up, but I was looking at ways that you can get the most out of your space. And uh, of course, there were um, all kinds of different wire racks and things inside cabinets to add more shelf space. So I said, of course, that would be the logical thing to do, the logical solution. And I found this uh, metallic wall uh, order. So I'm I'm still going to see which of them work the best. But I really love the metallic, even though it's rainbow and not just peacock. Um, I'm not sure if I'm going to use this for that um, or not. Um, I found a couple things that. One Dollar Tree where I went. These beautiful blue and green stickers. And they're all about cherish the little things. Cherish yesterday, live for today, dream for tomorrow. I cherish you. Cherish the simple things. Cherish, love and cherish. Cherish every memory, love every moment. Embrace every possibility. Pop-up stickers. So, so adorable. And you know, if you have been following my channel for any amount of time, you've probably seen me haul some of these pink pens in the past. Not pink, but this this shape of pen in different seasons. Now they have four different um, designs for Breast Cancer Awareness Month. And lo and behold, of course, I got the one that says pink on it. If my daughter sees it, it's going to be hers. <laughs> I got her a bracelet, breast cancer awareness bracelet, pink power, so cute. They had some other kinds there. They're, they had those ru uh, rubber one bracelets too, but those looked like they were too big. And this one looks so much smaller, I think it'll fit her wrist. Her wrist is teeny tiny. And I got a, 
pack of peacock colored um, glass beads. So I haven't decided yet what I'm going to do with those, but of course I had to have them if they're peacock colored. And this It is a breast cancer awareness pom-pom to put on your purse and it has a little uh, clip here to clip it on your purse. Cute, cute, cute. <laughs> they have so many um, breast cancer awareness things lately. Now, because I'm working on a DIY, I got this because I thought maybe the the gold glitter might work with it. Got some Crayola pencil <clears throat> sharpeners. There's the other Crayola pencil sharpener. I got, I don't know if I trust this, but I saw a whole bunch of these in the store you it's a wind cleaner for for uh, cleaning the computer in just one click it speeds up your computer works on all computers Windows and Macs so if that works then it's really worth it so all you do is open it and type the code in and the wind cleaner Dot org video help. Um, this is just really exciting and I'm a little scared to try it because I think of Trojan horses. <coughs> anyway, <clears throat> I found some of these whim decals. These are the, this one is the pineapple with the sunglasses and the different um, tropical exotic things, flamingos, palm trees, cactuses, parrots. So I thought those were cute. And this one is the unicorn one. It says unicorns are my spirit animal. <laughs> <coughs> and this one is just tropical and beautiful. And here I found some mirror mosaic stickers in gold. I, I looked at every store I went to. I found these at the first store I went to. And after that, I looked at every one I went to and didn't find any more. But I was thinking of trying to work these into my DIY. I wonder if this is a whole sticker or if I can take the each piece out. Peel and stick. Yeah, the individual leaves and flowers come off. So that'll be, that's good. Got a couple of books. My daughter had one like this in the past and then she gave it to one of her friends because her friend wanted it. And now um, I got her one, Dracula and the Step Momster. She had this, and sh she's more into Monster High than than I would have thought. But she likes them. And then I found this Generation Next book. It's about a YouTube um, YouTube generation. So I thought that would be interesting. It's about the YouTube sensation Ollie, what's his last name? Ollie White, I guess. And it's a novel. So that's very contemporary. Nothing classic about that. I found this uh, ribbon. It's, I don't know if you can see the ombre effect very well on this computer, but um, it's green to blue to teal. It's it's green, teal, blue. Um, 
and I think that is so pretty. And see how the curtains behind me are? I think this matches those curtains very, very nicely. And I want to work that into something. It just occurred to me that I might like to make a wreath. Or some kind of, yeah, a wreath with, with peacock colored ribbons. And I don't know if I could find peacocks to put on there or not. Now today, I didn't really save a last item because everything is my is my favorite today so i'm um i'm just pulling things out of the bag as they come because of i didn't have a specific favorite i just sort of like everything so much and i got four of these i was afraid i wouldn't find any of these anymore but I want to put these in on my big black shelf that I'm trying to decorate and I'm working on it so I can uh, instead of candles that burn with a fire I want to put these in the in the little uh, votive holders so that um, I don't put fire on that shelf because I don't want to put fire underneath a, a wooden shelf because it could get hot so these are the gold ones I the one I used in the big, at first it was uh, silver and the light I don't exactly like it very much so I decided to go with gold next because I think that would be more um, it would match the peacock theme more I think because the curtains are gold and the peacock feathers have gold highlights and um, I think that's how that will work out I got two, one polka dot burlap and one lace burlap uh, ribbon because I'm still deciding what will work with my DIY. It's right there and I'm looking at it, but I don't want to show you. I want to make a separate video with that. And I'm almost done with the last bag. I got some acrylic paint. I know I've seen them before at Dollar various Dollar Trees. Um, I got all the colors because acrylic is is a uh, something to snatch up when you find it at the Dollar Tree. This one is the blue. This is I have two white because I want to maybe mix white with other colors to make uh, because I want to mix colors to come up with other colors. This is the green and the red, um, purple. Purple and green make brown, don't they? Orange, yellow, and here's the other white. And here is the last item. And these are very good quality paint brushes from Jot. I saw different ones, and some look like the cheap ones. It was a package of five, and it looked like the cheap ones that come with the watercolor paint sets. So for the acrylic paints, I got these because I thought these looked so much better. Um, whether or not I'll actually use these for that, then I'm not sure. I might use those foam brushes that I bought uh, in the spring to use with Mod Podge. I might use one of those um, if I decide to go with paint on that thing. Anyway, that's the end. Thank you for hanging out with me. Have a great hump day. Like, share, subscribe, leave comments. Bye-bye.